Hey everyone, Lisa here and today I have some bedside tables that I'm making over. These are bedside tables from our master bedroom and I'll be using my homemade chalk paint recipe to paint these again as well as going over them with a dry brush technique and we're also going to be changing the handles on them to give them a more of a French country look. I really like our bedroom furniture but it just I just wanted to freshen it up with a colour change. So let's get started. First I'm going to give these a quick sand, just a quick hand sand using 120 grit paper, mainly because there's just a, a few surface scratches on these over the time. I did that to both the tables. And now for the homemade chalk paint. The paint I'm using here is just normal interior wall paint. The brand I've got is Accent. So the base colour will be the Stormy Shadow. Then I'll be doing the dry brush technique over that with the Tranquil Retreat. So for my chalk paint recipe, which is what I've used in quite a few of my projects. I use one third of a cup of plaster of Paris mixed with one third of a cup of water and then add this to one cup of the paint of your choice. So you can see here I mix the plaster of Paris and the water together first to form a smooth paste and then I add my one cup of paint to this mix. So here I'm using the Stormy Shadow Paint, as you can see. So then I mix all this together until it forms a nice smooth paste and it's all mixed in evenly. And because it's a chalk paint, we can just paint this straight onto the furniture. So let's get painting. So here's the drawers now. I ended up giving them three full coats of the grey and what I'm doing here now is the dry brush technique. So what I've done is I've dipped my brush very lightly in the lid of the light grey which was the Tranquil Retreat and then I've dabbed off most of that paint onto a cloth and then with what's left on that brush just very very lightly brush over the edges with this paint so that it leaves like a lighter highlight over the edges and wherever you want the paint to go. But the trick here is to, like the technique says, using pretty much a dry brush as you can see that I'm doing here. And then once I had done the edges, I then started to feather that paint across the surfaces of the drawers as well. And this just, just gives it like an antique vintage sort of French country look to it. Even though the style of drawers is not necessarily French country, but at least the paint technique gives it that aged look. And again, you can see here just on the side of the drawers, I am also just dragging that light grey across the surface as well. Thank you. 
So this is the painting finished now. You can see it just gives it that little bit of an aged look. And these handles here I bought from eBay. They were actually only about $9 for a pack of 10. And I think they just finish off the pieces nicely, just to give it that French country charm. Well, that's another one down, guys. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. And if you did, click subscribe because I have the rest of my bedroom furniture makeover coming up. The next piece will be my dressing table. So keep an eye out for that one coming up. Thanks for watching again and I'll see you in my next video.